inhuman. Claims he made a deal with the devil. Which is nonsense. You know, the rationalist in me wants to agree, but Skull on Fire presents a pretty compelling argument for Hail Satan. That's We still good? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. The more just polyadaptive material is the most sophisticated compound that S.H.I.E.L.D. has. That's not possible. Agent May was right about Isodyne. Peggy Carter and her team encountered them back in the 40s. They were conducting experiments on something called Zero Matter or Dark Force. Who names these? Are there focus groups for evil things? Isodyne doesn't exist anymore. Its assets were acquired by Rocks Incorporation in the 50s. Hey, Rocks! And guess who owns all the land deeds to Momentum Lab facilities? Coconut. Are you gonna guess? Well, it seems like kind of a no brainer, but. Is it Roxon? It's like your psychic. This Roxon power plant closed down years ago because of safety violations, but if Lucy Bauer can get it operational, it's got more than enough power for our experiment. Do not negotiate with terrorists. I don't think it's fair to paint Mr. Reyes as a terrorist. He's a murderer who attacked us and threatened to take down this entire plane if we didn't cede to his demands. How is that not a terrorist? It sounds a little Fox News to me, but... You're not wrong. It doesn't change the fact that we have no way to contain Mr. Reyes. He's also the only person we know who can take out Lucy Bauer. We need him. Yeah. You'll have to pay for what he did. I agree. But today's not that day. Okay, I've done everything you've asked. There's no way to turn this off. This plant was shut down for a reason. It could blow at any time. Joe was a genius. And he ruined his life. Joe got what he deserved. My nephew's in a wheelchair because of those thugs he hired. Oh, don't act like you're innocent in all of this. It's that damn book. I tried to warn you about it. You wouldn't listen. Joe, <gasps> I told you to stay out. You need help. Okay, look, we're worried about you, okay? Just, just give me the book. Get out! Uh. Get out! I don't even know what this project's goal is anymore. We are still creating matter from nothing, but the book revealed something exciting. We no longer need a machine to generate it. Joe's trying to generate matter himself? He wants to be a god. You are just jealous. Because you want the book for yourself. You're damn right. I want it so I can destroy it before it destroys all of us. I've got some big, fat, disappointing news. I can't hack in or shut down the plant's operating system from here. Well, you're out of practice. Too much punching, not enough hacking. Very funny. No, I can't hack in because their system isn't on a network. It predates the internet. Colton, how did anything ever get done back in the old timey days? I ask myself that all the time. <laughs> OK, you heard Daisy. We're going to have to do this from the inside. Fitz and Mac, you're the engineers. Focus on shutting the power plant down. We'll rescue Eli Morrow. Find my uncle. I've got this. Am I supposed to be afraid of you? Yes. My uncle is Eli Morrow. Of course. You're his nephew, Gabriel. Like the angel. No. No. I'm the other one. It wasn't supposed to be you boys. Joe hired that gang to take out Eli. You think that makes me feel better? Oh, I don't okay. Care how it makes you feel. I just wanted you to understand why I'm going to kill him. I need you to get this out of here. Okay, but shouldn't we dismantle all of this first? If this book is half as powerful as everyone thinks it is, then getting it out of here and hiding it somewhere safe is our top priority. You're the only one I trust. What, what about one of those, uh, those perpetual EMPs from Miami? Maybe it would disrupt all of this without blowing us the kingdom come. Yeah, let's do it. All right, there's one on the Zephyr. I'll have Daisy send it down in the containment module. Daisy. You copy? Colson. All right, hold down the fort. I'll be right back. Mr. Morrow, we have to get you out of here. Where's the book? Did she take the book? Shield has it. It's safe. You're safe. Stay away from this equipment. It's very dangerous. 
Do you understand how this works? Can you help me dismantle it? Yes, of course. But why would I? But it's taken me this long to achieve. Stand down! Stand down! We got a situation. I need your help so bringing the EMP back inside. Let's go. Move out. I had a husband I loved. Work. Is it because you read it? Challenged and thrilled me. Or he and touched just it? everything that I dreamed of. Was oh God! Like if he, if it's because he touched <laughs> it, then May and Coulson are screwed. But I'm going to make it all right. Maybe I wasn't clear about who I am. How many innocent people have died because of what you've done? I'm here to make you pay for your actions. I want to see the book. Well, I don't have it. Joseph does. And he's not here. And you will never get it. What have you done with them? <laughs> Same thing that I'm gonna do to you. Stop it, yet. This will kill me. <laughs> You weren't against Joseph getting the power. You just wanted it for yourself. Okay, so you're insane with the book. <laughs> you have the same fire. No. Mine's worse. It was you the whole time. It took a lot longer than I had hoped. In all those years in jail, I had to plan very carefully. Listen, if I were you, I'd get the hell out of here. Coulson. Oh, there's not even like a little end scene. What? I do not appreciate this. Where is Coulson? Oh, yikes. Well, um, I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this episode. Uh, that was episode six titled The Good Samaritan. We got to know like the backstory of, I guess, Eli and uh, Robbie, which is good, yeah. What the hell's wrong? Like, where are our characters? Where do they go? <laughs> oh my god, and Fitz as well. Oh no, oh shit, oh no, I need to watch the next episode. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Uh -oh.